Welcome to Academic Game Tutorials. In this video, we will look into the differences between gear drive and chain drive. Mechanical power transmission systems are used to transmit power, motion and torque from driver shaft, a prime mover such as electrical motor, to the driven shaft. In case of gear drive, power and motion are transferred from one shaft to another shaft through successive engagement and disengagement of teeth of two mating gears. Teeth are cut on both the gears and one such gear is mounted on driving shaft while other gear is mounted on the driven shaft. There is no requirement of ancillary element other than two mating gears. Contrary to this, chain drive is suitable for comparatively long distance power transmission requirements, however, load carrying capacity of chain drive is comparatively small. In chain drive, sprocket is mounted on each of the driving and driven shafts while an endless chain connects the sprockets. So, let's look into the basic differences between gear drive and chain drive in a tabular form. Difference number 1, gear drive is one engagement type mechanical drive as power and motion are transferred by means of successive engagement and disengagement of teeth of mating gears, whereas, Chain drive is also one engagement type mechanical drive but power and motion are transferred by means of successive engagement and disengagement of chain with sprocket. Number 2, no additional element is required in gear drive, only two gears are sufficient for power transmission, whereas, in chain drive, apart from two sprockets, a chain is indispensably necessary for power transmission. Number 3, gear drive is not one flexible drive. Thus, it cannot protect the driver unit from vibrations induced in driven unit, whereas, presence of flexible element like chain makes it one flexible drive. It can easily isolate vibrations, and thus can protect the driver. Number 4, gear drive is suitable for small center distance between driver and driven shafts, whereas, chain drive can be employed for short as well as medium center distances between driver and driven shafts. Number 5. For the same center distance, gear drive requires more space. The drive unit is also heavy, whereas, chain drive is compact and thus space efficient. Drive unit is light in weight. Number 6, gear drive requires precise center distance otherwise performance will degrade sharply, whereas, center distance is not so critical for chain drive. A small error is tolerable without much effect. Number 7, gear drive requires full lubrication. For best performance and longer life in heavy-duty applications, gears must be partially immersed into lubricating oil, whereas, chain drive also requires lubrication to reduce noise and wear of joints, however, it does not require full lubrication, periodic lubrication is sufficient. Number 8, gear drive can be utilized for parallel, spur and helical gears, intersecting, bevel gear, and non-intersecting non-coplanar, worm gear shafts, whereas, chain drive is suitable for parallel shafts only. Number 9, operation of gear drive is quiet, whereas, operation of chain drive is noisy. And, difference number 10, a wide range of velocity reduction, from 1 is to 1, to 1 is to 40, is possible with gear drive, whereas, chain drive is not suitable for high velocity reduction. It can be used when reduction is up to 1 is to 10, 